All right, hello. <clears throat> How's it going? Let's just fix this up. Boom, boom. All right. All right, we are ready to play some more Biomutant. So, um, continue the story, I guess. And I made a few decisions with this game. So, um, with the uh, audio settings, I've decided to put the narrator down to zero frequency. I'm not sure if this is going to... Um, like, I put it down to zero hoping that the narrator won't talk during um, dialogue just because to hear the gibberish and to hear the dialogue, the, like the narration, is just a bit too long and I kind of want to cut the game shorter um, a little bit and it's kind of not annoying but I can just read it out loud or, you know, some variation. Um, but yeah, if this frequency means like in battle talk then i guess we can put it back up but um this is volume and this is frequency so you see how we go uh, everything else is still the same <sighs> okay all right so let's continue i've been pretty excited to get back into this game um so yeah I think we left off uh, right near the fort area. Uh huh. Here we go. Give me one second. Okay. Um, all right, so I've got to remember how to play this game, dude. Now, I think it's over here. What's this? Okay, okay, so this is the quest for the base. Now, I wanted to check. Alright, uh, here's the ping dish. What's this? Capture rubble outposts. Okay. Um, I might also skip some side quests. I don't know. I kind of really want to do them, but... Um, but yeah, we'll see how we go. So we might skip them. adjusting some audio okay um i kind of want to i don't remember what was here i think there's a town here royal broker craft camp oh yeah we have the summon now, I wonder if there's anything that can affect the usage of the quick wheel controls. Um, control icons. No, it's not, it's not what I want. Mapping. Camera. Sh melee. Shoot. Reload. Harry, Wrong Fu, Super Wushu. Jeez, I think it's L1 when I do a certain combo or something. Which is kind of not the best way to have it, to be honest, but. Toggle ability, yeah, I can't change this, can I? Quick use ability. Where's the D-pad stuff? There's no, like, D-pad. Oh, 
Oh, here we go. Here we go. Hmm. Okay, it doesn't say anything about the usage, which kind of... It's kind of rough, because... There's no way to, like, cancel that. Hmm, yeah, it's really... Controller is really kind of lame for the quick select things. Yeah, it's not, I don't like it at all. Okay, that's right, there was this thing over here. We can grab and smash. So it's gonna, the game's probably gonna be a little bit more quieter now because we have no narrator. Um, I don't mind him talking actually during cut, during, um, what's it called? During like fighting scenes or during combat, rather. However, I don't like the dialogue with the. With the um, benders and stuff like that, it just makes it unnecessarily like longer for like, no reason. Okay, and that's the bunker. Okay, I think I know where I am. Can we? Sp I think we can sprint with this guy. Now, is this bunker still glitched? That's why another thing I wanted to check before we do the... Yeah, I think it's still bugged. Um, yeah, see, now it's really quiet. The game feels really quiet with the narrator, like, completely off. Another thing is the waypoints also don't really appear on the actual map. Like they appear on the map, but they don't appear on like the like the an actual in, in actual game. They're only on the in-game map, not like out. Once you like um, start controlling a character, it doesn't have like on your HUD. It's kind of what I mean. Okay, I think I've explored this. Oh, Jesus. Oh my god, he was like not even in there. Oh my god, why am I so weak? What the? It does this weird thing where it like glitches out. Oh my god, now I'm stuck. And I'm, it doesn't like kick him into the air. Okay, there we go. Okay, so it's, it's not here. Where, where's the town? It's behind me. It's not really a town, but... Okay, it's just a little camp. Okay, here we go. Here's like a little camp. 
Did I interact with this? Let's see. Oh, there's an arrow there, okay. Wow, oh, okay. Huh. Alright, let's just do the main story. There's something I thought that there was around here, and it, and it wasn't. I just remembered that I knew I had to go left to get some things. One of them was the. Uh, one of them was that. Um, what's it called? The uh, the stand of of rubber or whatever that I just hit earlier. No, I thought there was something else, but. Wait, here we go. Wow, never mind. I'm not really gonna find them again. Okay, where's the uh alright, it's pretty much straight. Okay, let's take over this uh outpost. Says they've been waiting for you to help them liberate I'm ready. So Naruto does even on zero while you can and don't stop until all outposts are under your control. Roger, got it. Says Scout spotted a moth nest close to the outpost. If you destroy that, the moths should infest the place. Look how that help. I'm gonna skip a little bit or cut it short. Figures the moths will drive everyone in the outpost nuts. Okay, is it under here though? Okay, it is. Alright, so let's, now that we've got the settings, uh, audio, so now we should probably, let's see if we put gibberish down to zero, see what happens there. What the? Ah, oh, the nest. I see. Okay, that doesn't seem to be doing anything. Just get I have to. I literally have to melee. It. Come on, Nick. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come get me. Come get me. Oh, Jesus. I was not ready for you. What the hell? Where's my parry, bro? What? Excuse me? Is my button? Is my button not working? I think my button's not working. What the hell? There we go, what the frick? Is my timing just that bad, huh? Him out. What the? Ah. Oh. I can like st I can like stun him, can't I? As I. Oh shit. The boomerang is kind of, uh, maybe it's because I'm on controller, the aiming is not the best. I feel like the boomerang is like a little, like obviously it's slow, but the aiming. Here we go, we got Mr. Big Boy out here.
Damn, I gotta, f I gotta remember to like. There we go, parry. And and hit square right after the parry. It's really small window. <sighs> All right, sweet. I'm adapting to the combat pretty well. Normally, when I like come back to the game after playing another game, like I was playing some Nordica in between this. So sometimes it takes me a while to get used to, but. Man, combat is like kind of fun, dude. Combat really is like pretty good. Can't block those shots. You can't block any like range shots at all, so you just kind of gotta strafe. Oh, I know what to do here. It's mad how you can go like so far. Oop, that's not exactly good aiming right there. Level zero needed. What? Nice work. No more moths nest. That was me. What was that? Level zero needed? Is that maybe uh the moths toward the outpost? They're good and mad. The outpost belongs to you. Oh, is that all? Now. What the hell? I didn't have to like enter the outpost and like attack it and infiltrate it or anything? That was he says strange. You made them weaker, but they won't give up. Hmm. Your Sifu thanks you. Your tribe is growing stronger. Okay. That was that was weird. That's all it took for them to like get wiped out. Or drive them out, and who who leaves a who leaves a hornet's nest underneath their outpost? I mean, come on. Oh, new outfits, tribe gear unlocked. Ah, cool. He says you did a great job capturing the rival second outpost. You've earned the privilege of wearing, wearing the, the tribe's, tribe's colors. Wear the pride. Believes you'll make them all proud. Okay. Can I actually take it off? <laughs> Don't super like the look of it, but it's whatever. Um, character, we got to level up. What do we got here? Seventy-eight, fifty-eight. I think I put some into charisma last time, right? Something like that. So I could put I can't put any into resistances, huh? Which is interesting. So we'll put it into strength and then next one be intellect. Now I'm save we've got some more upgrade points, okay. Perks. Probably good to save for two, right? Armor value increased. Unarmed attack, no. Automated inflict, no. Range weapons have their reload time, no. Okay. So, waiting for a saboteur level two. Because everything else I've pretty much got. Close combat and all that. 
two hand two wheeled melee maneuvers yeah she won through yeah okay gear myriad headwear what did I have on before I don't remember um 19 armor 24 24 but uh, and a little bit of key energy shoulder pad torso okay 36 so we'll need 12 29 36 all right so we've got 36 here which we don't even need this this is literally the worst so we can scrap this well i might want to sell it actually instead five it's worth five thousand that's pretty that's a lot all right um offhand oh yeah we can do the weapons now myriad now it's probably the best pants i've got to be honest 15 add-ons two though energy and critical 13 Hmm. I don't care too much about critical chance. Probably this one, even though it's eleven though, which isn't the best. I mean, the add-ons. Do I even have um? Like add ons to put on it. I don't think I do right now. And what else we got? Uh, main hand, we got a back. We only got one cold pack, okay. Oh, yes, we got modifies right here. Cook a chunk. How come that's more than this? And it's got that's the same but critical chance. Hmm. Maybe it's because of the materials it's made of, maybe. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I guess rubber and that water is better more abundant than water and butt and water and chip or whatever that thing is now I don't remember if I can take off or on the add-on so I want to try and test something cheap like we'll put on copper chunk I know but it'll cost materials that's okay Now if I how do I, now if I just take it off, can I take it off? Wait. Uh now do I I wanna make sure if I wanna see if I get it back. What the What? Why do I have all no add ons on it now? What the hell? What? It doesn't make any sense. I can only knock what? Modify it once, maybe? So then, do I have the copper chunk still or not? I do. And it's, it's taking my resources as well. It hasn't even given them back to me. So I don't know what's going on there. Rarity 100, ultimate. I don't know what's so rare. How is that rarity 100?
20 uncommon. Pants, pants. Rarity 40, rare. 100 ultimate. I don't know why that makes it so rare. Like, what, what's the benefit of having something so rare? That's 2 star. Uncommon 20. That's just common. It says 100, but it's, this one's worth more? This is 2 stars. This is, one, this is 2 stars also, but it's rare. I'm so I'm so confused with like the rarity and just the whole gear like system. I don't understand like I don't really understand it all. Like I don't understand this. I understand stats. I just don't understand how the like the visual feedback that's being presented to me on on the on the top side, the rarity quality material and and the two star. I don't understand exactly what that means. Like, what's the benefit of me, of like, telling, well, like, what are you trying to tell me as a game, you know? This is, oh, this is Pleated Shorts Plus. Okay, is that because I put, is that because I put an um, add-on on it? But then I, I took it off, so I'm not sure what that's doing now. Alright, let's try, uh, Pants Pants, 2550. 2550... Um, 15, 2550, and it's 15 armor, and it's rarity 20, 25, 2550, 15, and rarity 20. Okay. So it's gone up to thirty two forty. Twenty five fifty. Um so it's gone up ooh, how much? Twenty five. So it's twenty five thirty two seven seven hundred six hundred and six hundred ninety. And now the arm is twenty two instead of fifteen. And the rarity is still 20, is impressive, but now if I... Say, okay, so it's rarity 20, uncommon, rarity 20, impressive, okay. So I think before it was uncommon, right? And this will take it down to 15. But it doesn't say anything about getting rid of add-ons. Okay, what about if I scrap it? Oh shit, no. Dismantle. I'm gonna dismantle this item into its components. Copper chunk, and eight, and, and pants pants. Okay, now it's back to 15. Okay, so that's how I can dismantle them, I guess. As opposed to if I put this on Big. It still costs materials. Look, now it's 49 instead of 50. I'm wasting a bit of materials testing this, but... Okay. Yeah, so now I've got 48 instead. So now if I just dis dismantle that. If I craft it with no add-ons. Add-ons to 15. Add-ons 0. Okay, so... Uh, I'm not sure if that's a bug. I mean, it says. I mean, what does it say now? It says pants, pants plus. But rarity common. I don't understand like really what how that happened. Like, I guess removing an add-on kind of f's up the pants. If you just like, if you just remove it, but then this, then didn't you have dismantling? It just doesn't make. It just doesn't make sense. Doesn't make sense. Anyway, I don't know. 
So I guess you've always wanna dis you always want to dismantle it into its separate pieces instead of just removing. So I'm not sure if that's a bug where you s if you're able to take it off, no no problem. Because you can essentially do that by dismantling, and they're putting that into its separate parts. It's just no difference. Okay, let's um. Let's look at some vendors and stuff around here. We've got nothing over here. Is this the same layout? None for me, old Says back in the old times, sludge just piped into your house. Okay, okay. Now you must wait for a truck to bring a sludge to you. And there's this light. They're desperate for their sludge. Could you figure out what happened to the sludge truck? So what's sludge? Has the truck been late before? What do you think stopped the sludge truck? Uh, has, has the truck been late before? Thinks, yeah, the sludge truck is late all the time, but never this late. Says the sludge truck usually comes from that direction. Ah yes, helpful. That direction. Just go find the truck and figure out what happened to it. Otherwise, they're going to run out of sludge fast. You may as well point to the sky. Seems choked up about it, but it might just be the air crud around here. Find the sludge trucks. Okay. Where's the, uh, where's the vendors around here? Ah, okay, the rooms have treasures now. A scope, bullseye scope. health pack okay so i guess the rarity number and the rarity uh word is different so you can have a rarity 20 like uncommon and a rarity 20 rare i guess so like i maybe because it's all they're all like 20 uncommon by default and then they go up depending on um like what you can craft on it maybe this is a 20 uncommon. Okay, there's no more houses. I think I've already been in here. Yes, okay. Now, vendors in this direction. You can interact with them, but usually the ones only with the exclamation mark give us a quest. So, I'm not going to talk to them unless they have exclamation mark. Alright, we got weapons. Let's have a quick look. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Browse. Thirty five thirty armor PS. Look at the accuracy. Alright, let's sell uh let's sell weapons and stuff while we're here. If we can. Still need twelve vitality thirty. It reduces bullet spread to zero degrees. Vitality thirty, exploder and jackhammer. What do make rifles? Okay, so we got Automatic rifles, rifles, guns. How about we make a gun just for the fun of it? Automatic rifle, we got shotgun. Increase the range by 12 meters. But we don't have any... Do we have a grip of some kind? 
craft. Can I even craft a... How do I... How do I craft a range? I think I asked this last stream. Oh, I want, I want. Okay, there we go. Craft new ranged. Okay, I kind of want to put up all the... I kind of want to, like, uh, calculate... Let's get my phone out. How much profit I can make by make crafting or if it costs me, like, in terms of money-wise. Okay, so let's see if we can actually make some stuff. Gun, rifle, shotgun, automatic rifle. So let's make a automatic rifle. No, no, no. Let's make, sorry, a... Explonder Ice Shotgun, which is valued at 2210. Let's do some science thing right here. 2210. Alright, now we've got Grip. We've got Oxy. So 710, uh, 760, sorry. 760 plus. Stock, clone stock, range increases. Okay, that's 470 plus top mod bullseye, armor pierce, range a little bit increased. Uh, I think my internet cut out, so we're going to wait a little bit. Bullseye 760. Magazine size 626, 628. Way rather the large magazine box. Muzzle. Two, five, four, six, one, three, six. Armor pierce way higher there. And this one doesn't really increase anything, so. So probably the dopey. <laughs> Very really 40 remarkable, spectacular. So look at the costs. Eight six four six six. All right. So this I'm gonna check if the stream is back up. Uh, it's coming back up slowly. So I'll wait till the internet comes back up. It's still recording, so we're good. This the stream's going down. Um, and yeah, so we'll make this and we'll see how much profit I can actually make when I sell it. Um, but I might, I might probably just keep it, but I also want to just see the profit I make from it. I'm not sure if there's any, like, there's doesn't seem to be any downsides of putting, like, like, a stock and, like, a huge barrel for a shotgun, you know, and uh, having a scope, you know, normally that would, like, decrease something because, like, you're trying to make a shotgun, like, with too much range or something, and it, like, gives you some sort of downside, but I guess not. 
Um, if we're coming back on slowly, let's just grab this. Click that. Okay, we're back up, I think. Boom. Just refresh. All right. Almost there. All right, sweet. Okay, seems we're back. All right. Uh, muzzle. We got Lum, Dopey, and Fret, which is armor piece. Armor piece is the best for this one, regardless of the damage. That's two two more damage max between these two and this one's plus three, but we'll go to armor pierce. Now rarity forty spectacular. I also want to see the rarity differences actually. So let's bring up the calculator again. Just guard them for one second. Um, base Explonder. Um, so it's rarity 20 uncommon right now. Grip Oxy. So it's rarity 20 impressive. So impressive defunct 2 composite 1. Automatic rifle, wait. Why is it automatic rifle? I didn't make automatic rifle. It's a shotgun. Type shotgun. Shotgun one and a half. Stock. Clunk stock. Impressive 20. Frosty defunct. So we got one and a half stars, impressive, defunct, two, and composite one. Defunct two, composite one, okay. Magazine. So this, this makes it a two star. Increases quality to three. Material is the same. And it's still rarity 20 impressive. So this is defunct two, defunct two, and this is recrack three. Even though that's Rick Rack 3, like high quality, I prefer the extra magazine. Look at the difference in the magazine from 12, from a 12 to 26. It's got high, slightly higher armor pierce, but lower damage, but the quality goes up, which I'm not really fussed about. And the cost is, I don't know, 7, uh, 5, that's 10. 15, 20, 20, 24, and this one's 5, 10, 15, 20, 22, 25. Okay, now I'll top mod. So you got two star impressive, defunct two comps at one. So now it's rarity 40, remarkable. So it goes from two star to two and a half because of this is this mod is like a legendary mod or whatever it's yellow <sighs> all right so now that just gives us critical chance armor pierce now the quality has gone from two all the way to five power wow okay and then we got muzzle we got remarkable spectacular remarkable power wow so you say material goes from rock to two Rockated 2 or Meso 5. And I guess Spectacular is better than Remarkable. Yeah, because it's. Yeah, this is a yellow mod, that's why. Okay. 643. 
Right, now let's look at the price. So we've got we've got 470 plus 760 plus 2210 plus 760 plus 1650 that comes to a total of 5970 5970 so let's craft this the crafting aspect in the game is really cool. First time I've really like kind of looked at it and delved into it. So that's that. So five thousand seven nine hundred and seventy. Okay, so it's legit like equal, like exactly the same. Now, if I dismantle this, it'll give me all the parts back. Okay, so if I modify it. This changes the whether it's a rifle or automatic rifle and all, all of that. So you could just okay. So I'll probably just dismantle this into its parts. I'll keep the weapon. Could make this a katana. That'll be dope. Instead of whatever it else it is, decrease the critical chance, but increases add-ons. However, the handle, handle. Uh, don't really have anything super great. Seventy-nine to one thirteen. It's a better, it's a better, like it's a better distance. Seven, eight, that's a plus two for minimum, but minus one for max. It's a tight, it's a tighter window for sure, but. Don't really have any good handles. Yeah, I don't really have that many like good parts for the. PSR wobble blade. That's a single handed edge blade overpowered. Yeah, I need some better I need some better handles. I think. Okay. Now, I'm actually keen to try out this, um... Cowboy hat? What? Oh, there's two add-ons. Okay. Man, I can really add... Put the add-ons, like, onto anything. Shoulder pad? Okay, so I'll get an extra one of those. What else is... Oh, inventory. Range pass. Oh yeah, because I've dismantled those. Alright, you don't really need to like tell me I've got new stuff there, but anyway, okay, so let's double check our selling. And if we sell weapons PvP Bosk Spry. Okay, so I can sell this at 2,030, but it's worth 5,970 all up. That's pretty much all my, all my um, components together. That's how much it would that cost me to make. So that is definitely not worth it. It's definitely worth it to like craft. I was thinking that maybe when we craft, 
the selling price will be a bit more so we can sort of just craft this random rubbish and then sell it for a bit of profit but we can't <sighs> anyway um so it's kind of it's probably worth more worth it to sell the parts like a click click is worth 610 for example right so if we go craft And we look at click click. Okay, so it's 1640. Is like what the base price? So maybe I have to increase my charm must my sorry, my charisma skill and that I might actually be able to sell for a better price. So I guess it's just not really worth it to almost it's almost not even worth it to sell, but I guess you have to, right? That's like you have to you have to sell at one at some point. Like this, let's, I don't know, let's give, give me an example with, uh, like what can I sell here, for example. Like this, Berserker t-shirt, 5330, 5330. 37, so 53 and 37. Two and a half, 30, 40, rare, Rick Rack 3. 40, rare 3 and 7. Plus two, two and a half. This is two stars. This is two and a half, rarity 40, 40 rare. 40 rare 3, 7. 40 rare 3, 7 as well. But that's 2.5. And, and this is just 2. But this is better, like way better. Um, let's go to the closing. Can I not s can I not sell that? Oh, that, that's legendary. Oh, the anti biohazard crop top. Oh, that's buying. Okay, never mind. Never mind. I'm a fool. Like this, 1920, and it's uh, uh, like it's worth like 57 something. Man, that rate is really not good. But let's sell st stuff I don't need right now. Do you not want to sell that? Hang on, do I not have that? I've got the wrong thing equipped. Pounds for. Do I have any add ons on this torso? No, I do not. So that would increase it even more. Okay. Let's sell some stuff. Alright, let's go close. Torso wear. Alright, 36. What are we looking for here, really? We've got health and energy regen galore. So maybe we'll look at the highest key regen I've got. Key energy, sorry. So, like this. Level needed 20. Key energy is through the roof. Add ons 4. So. And the health, is, the health is better as well. It's just that the armor is a bit low. So we can keep that. Key energy is lower. But it's 29, though. So the higher the stats, the less armor we've got. 
And this is 17 and it's got like myriad stuff has like nothing. So it's probably more worth it to sell those. So I sell this. I don't really want to sell this, but like I'm not sure if maybe we're gonna need it for a quest or something. 